Inside your body, blood moves oxygen, nutrients, and other important molecules through arteries and veins. Inside Earth, elements and molecules also move around, dissolved in watery fluids. Scientists in the Deep Carbon Observatory are trying to understand how this massive internal circulation system works so that they can figure out how much carbon is contained in Earth and how it cycles into and out of the atmosphere. This work is challenging because we can't travel 400 kilometers into the planet where pressures are 100,000 times what they are at the surface and temperatures top 700 degrees Celsius. This is where computer modeling comes in. By using basic facts about how our atoms behave, Ding Pan and Julia Galli noticed an anomaly in widely used models of deep earth fluids. They show that under the intense pressures and temperatures of Earth's interior, water chemistry changes. This means that carbon in Earth is not carbon dioxide, but more reactive carbonate and bicarbonate ions. This changes our estimates of how much carbon is in Earth, how it moves, and how it reacts with rocks and minerals. DCO, changing what we know about Earth.